making quite a splash when he was a member of the uh, LA Kings, Wayne Gretzky. He was involved with Team Canada as uh, he looks ahead to Salt Lake City. 529 remaining in this fourth quarter. The Sixers lead by four. Sixers are certainly getting the maximum of fouls out of their center. Tandem Geiger is back. He's playing with five. Fox to the rim. Sixer lead is down to two. McKinney. Here comes Bryant. Fox. And O'Neill is fouled. If it's Geiger, it's number six. It is. Matt Geiger has fouled out. Attacks the basket, and again, no shot blocker back there. He goes right to the front of the rim. And then Matt Geiger doing his best to try to hold Shaq out of there. Shaq with a great touch rebound to himself. And the loose ball foul. Geiger fouls out. He has six. Matumbo has five. That's 11. McCullough has at least one. So 12 fouls now by the big man of the Philadelphia 76ers. Shaq has to convert these free throws. 19 at the line. Matt Geiger in 13 minutes. Did it at the offensive end. 5 for 7. 10 points. But at the defensive end, a different story. Shaq firing line drives now. And he, uh, he's been out of sync. 9 for 20 at the line. The Sixers have got to free up Iverson. Since Lou has come into the game, he's used his quickness. He's not been able to get open. They've got to find a way to get him a clean shot. Iverson has rarely been able to handle the basketball in the second half. Hill, and he's fouled. Hit in the upper lip by Bryant. That's four on Kobe. And for the Lakers, their second team foul. The 76ers are over the foul limit. Dikembe, you're going to see him get hit in the mouth inadvertently by Kobe Bryant. That's twice now he's been hitting the mouth. Lewis Johnson reported he had a cut in his upper lip. The Sixers are going to talk it over. They lead by two, 4-10 to go. Can they hold on? As you can see, Allen Iverson on fire. First 29 minutes, 38 points. He has been cooled off the last 15 minutes. Well, you got to give Teron Lou a lot of credit. He's just shadowing him wherever he goes. Look at him. You can't shoot the ball if you don't get it in your hands. And you can see what Lou is doing. And then when he gets up the ball, look at him. The trap box comes over, force him to give the ball up. No shot attempts. And what this also does is you see Lou, what he has done, plus 13 since he's in the game. But remember, one of the things that Sixers feast off it, of is offense rebound and if Iverson's not penetrating they lose a big part of their offense 76ers with a 92 90 lead as we come up on four minutes remaining in the fourth quarter Sixers trying to hold on to pull off the stunner in game one of the NBA finals knocked away from the head Aaron McKee looks like he'd come up a little gimpy on that play. We'll have to keep our eye on him. McKee tried to work it out. He was hobbling, defending on Fox. Fox goes right at him. McKee is struggling, you can see. Bryant, played by Bell. He's done a good job. Five o'clock at three. Here's Kobe Bryant. Work 
kicks it out. Being pressured by Fox. They cannot get the ball to Iverson. Now Iverson returns to Bell. Shot clock running down. Iverson for three. Fox. Lakers with their third team foul. It's a non-shooting affair. Fox with his second. It's like Rick Fox is hurt. Now, Eric Snow has come back in the game for Roger Bell. Remember now, Eric Snow makes big shots. So if they're going to trap and double team, he's been known to step up and hit big shots. So now he and Aaron McKee both are capable of making jumpers if they're going to trap Iverson. to strip Iverson. That's team foul number four on uh, the Lakers. The 76ers already over the foul limit. Well, you can see the Laker defense right now. Wherever Iverson goes, he's being trapped. Either a big man is coming over to help, a small forward. They are not going to allow him to work one-on-one -on -one here in the last two and a half minutes of this game. Phil Jackson staying with Teron Lewis on Allen Iverson. Iverson his shots have been coming up short down the stretch. I think he's gotten a little tired, and, and he should. I mean, as much energy as he has placed out in this game, and, but Lou has done a great job with help from his teammates. Bryant trying to shake off Snow. Here's Bryant. inside he forces a tough shot but mark watch what happens when he shoots this ball 